uh, it's part three uh, and I'm rebuilding uh, an app from uh, my old experiments with view 2 with V and view 3 and so on uh, we've got the controls we've got the uh, uh, the table with cells uh, works pretty nice and um, we've uh, added the uh, BPM and the frequency component and um, here we can uh, first of all uh, use uh, the uh, components that we've uh, already used and um, like here we have the control switch and we have we can have two another one let it be one so it's it will be frequency frequency like this freak and uh, this will be freak Frequency and not frequency and here the last one frequency yeah so here it works and um, all we need is uh, this so this will be the if um the if state show frequency yeah yeah so here we have it turn on and off very nice uh okay i think don't be so lazy please make it make it like here and here and here will be uh bpm yeah and the control will be for bpm2 bpm bpm and bpm and here we have this bpm thing yeah nice and of course we can see that we need a margin x2 yeah <laughs> pretty nice uh, pretty cool uh, things uh, maybe margin right like that my margin right is bad it's too, it's too okay uh, also maybe padding will be less and let the text be SM S uh, small and also let the let it be PY1 and PX2 uh, two. PX2 two, P, P, mm, no PX and the letters the text should have a margin right uh, of one yeah so these are the numbers that make everything uh, so um, consistent so we don't have ems px just numbers that are gradations of the parameters so uh, that's pretty nice we can turn on and off the um what we have here everything and um i think text should have um oh, not not text it's okay to have text there but what i'm thinking about is the cell and the table frequency um it should have a padding of some kind just a little bit yeah and uh, also it um, I think it shouldn't be uh, centered anymore I think that M auto isn't needed here and also uh, the item center isn't needed here 
flex flex column is okay yeah like that so it's it's like on the on the right and also px is one he is is not here px cell but the letter uh, the letter will have a p p x y eight one okay uh, like that pretty nice pretty, pretty formatted and it shows us what 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 it can show uh, it's rather nice okay uh, what's next uh, the next thing is to make the um, this this thing it's I just dropped it there <laughs> so we have a uh, octave range and it goes just one two three four five six but what we had in the initial uh, table and what I've came up, uh, came up with uh, just with the um, experimental my <laughs> experiments uh, we can have minus six octave if we want some rhythm and uh, ninth octave is the top uh, level that we even can hear it's it's very very uh, high pitched sound so minus six and nine and uh, we need octaves and octaves will be a uh, computed so let's import import a computed from view and use it here so we have the function uh, that uh, will uh, return uh, what it, will, it should uh, return how it should work let's assume we have octave range and uh, we have computed octaves here um, I know it's it's rather easy <laughs> but I love that I've already done it and I can use it just straight away so octaves uh, I take the octave range from octave range 0 to octave range 1 we just push the number inside yes here we have it it's why not why is it oh. yes yes oh no no <laughs> oh of, of course of course octaves yeah that's it that's it and the last thing is that we want i want it to be reversed so from one to zero and minus minus Oh, is is um, I is greater? Yes, yes. So here are the mo the highest notes. And there we go down below. Here are the intermediate, and the, these are the rhythmic ones. Uh, minus I don't know what octave uh, it is. Minus. 6, minus 5, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, this is 0, and so on, so on. So, uh, this looks pretty nice. If we have uh, some touch controls on it, it may be a really powerful thing, I, I should say. But uh, first of all, we need uh, to have uh, uh, the, the, the te text color. And the text color is also what I've already um, done. I know this is note cell, and here is the background color and text color. And um, text color is something like this. This is text color. And there's. A, I, I'll take the comment with me. So it's in the cell we want we have already the text color so text color takes the octave 
it will be props octave uh, and uh, have active active for now active we don't have active but we'll have it and it will um, use it value value yes so text color background co color is is computed and text color should be computed also so we have const text color is computed computed function arrow function that we will have oh is equal to okay text color and active and props octave and that's that's it and here we have uh, color text color come on yeah yeah so everything below uh, maybe the, 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 the third octave will be in white text and it's readable it's really readable uh, nice nice uh, nice good uh, what should we do now uh, f one thing I forgot about totally and uh, I should done it, should have done it from the start I need to initialize a git repository here because it's it's the thing that you need to do but uh, of course I will uh, remove some assets like the logo I don't want it and in public there is five icon I will remove it for now too okay and uh, that's it uh, let's uh, initialize so first first commit yeah that's nice I don't have a repo so we will create one uh, it's public repository I'm uh, publishing it yeah so open in github and there we have it so it's pitch table and it's here uh, right for us to explore okay nice <laughs> what next uh, of course now we want to go and implement the touch interface that's the thing that is um, one of the two most crucial parts the uh, touch and uh, reactivity and the sound so don't js will be the last part i, I hope that uh, because sound is, uh, I'll have to be in uh, earbuds or something. It's it's easy to implement when you have the controls, and we will need to have the controls. And one thing that I haven't tried yet, but I really want to try, is view use gesture. So it's not only animated; it's rather reactive, and. Uh, I don't really know how it's uh, used, how it's meant to be used, but I think we can figure it out and find out how it's done. So let's dive in. It. So it's a viewport of a reactive gesture, additional layer, composable functions and directives, and uh, okay. So let's install it. We got PM, PM, I we use gestures, gesture. Then we have um, the, 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 the uh, main JS. We want the gesture plugin. It's uh, when we const app is create app app mount and here we use the 
plugin. Oh, oh, oh. No, no, no. Just this line. That line. Yeah. So the plugin is here. We can run our server. Hope everything is okay. Nothing breaks. Okay. And then we will find out how can we use it. So component install. Ah, oh, we've installed it. Now quick start. Entry file interact interact drag handler. Let's try it. Let's just just try what they tell us, and then we'll find some more details. So here we go. It's V drag drag handler, and we need the function drag handler. And uh, I don't know what drag state. So it takes uh, drag state, and let's console log drag state. Nice. And let me need the docs more. Nice. Okay some handler something is happening something is there but what is it we will okay so it touches it it ta ta uh, there's an object with some with some of things but gesture event data yeah we we need, we need about data so gesture state is called it when that includes attributes such as velocity uh, use pinch okay uh, uh vx vy previous Delta movement, distance, direction. Uh, wow, wow, <laughs> wow, wow, wow! It's not not so easy, but I think it it's comprehensible. Gesture options. What are the options? Dome target, event window enabled. Bounds transform. So, what are the gestures? Um, drag, drag, start. Will hover. So, what do we do with the hover scroll wheel? Maybe wheel. Maybe wheel is what we can use here. Use your mouse wheel or trackpad like this scroll handler okay let's try it ah we have the composable usage usage uh, so instead of having a handler we can have a ref but it's okay to have a handler Scroll handler on set motion integration. Oh, okay, I see. It's for motion, but motion is not what we need here. Okay, like we have to be wheel and our drag state will have something yeah but the only thing is that um, we need the, the wheel the, the wheel to oh nice we need the wheel to navigate this to, so 
it shouldn't be wheel it should be drag and uh, drag so x y yeah we set and the positions according to the grab swipe tap um, okay maybe it's maybe it's okay maybe move is what move inside the box mm -hmm. maybe I should stick to what I had there without uh, but no it's rather uh, hard to manage but finally it's what we need to do is move All right, I think it's the one that we need is drag. So if I'm grabbing cursor, things that's what we need. That's what we need. Right? Just this drag handler will be if not dragging we uh, set we just do nothing if else else if we are I'll just cons uh, you know I'll just uh, console log this and uh, let's try it No. Drag handler. Ah, B. Drag. Okay. No. B. Drag. Drag handler. If not dragging, return. Yeah. We get it. So. This gives me the x and y axis that I can use to adjust the two parameters that are um, just inside that will be uh, controlled for the node. Uh, I think that this will be volume up and down so it will be y axis and it's inverted so negative is will add some volume and also I'm thinking about panning panning so you will have you you should be able to create a composition of different noises some pitches from different places uh, so the two parameters and um, I think it's nice it's it's rather rather handy yeah uh, okay and uh, now we need uh, the um, to show the parameters that we have and uh, I need to find the right uh, metaphors so I have a cell and there will be a column uh, for volume uh, it will be done with a flex uh, container that have has a narrow container and another and in it will go its child that will have variable width uh, and uh, lo at the bottom will have another one but the child will be centered okay i think it's really doable if 
for us okay so from here we understand that the cell is a container for um, it should be a little bit more complex so now it's flex column so everything is one column but uh, now I will use this cell it will be inside another flex component that will have a, a volume next to it so the volume and volume will uh, be uh, will have uh, I think I should write a style from there so volume has a width of um, maybe six pixels yeah and also it's um, I'll apply some classes to it so it's flex flex and uh, the height so it's flex it's items and yeah okay and then in the volume inside of it we'll have the volume vol indi indicator and this will have a style with height being uh, some number some uh, it will be like vol and uh, percent just percent uh, so it will be in percents yes I know that vol is not here okay I again I forgot about the the brackets the brackets and uh, wall is not uh, defined but I'll define it here so we have uh, we have uh, we'll have volume we will have uh, the um, panning and I think that we, it should be like we should um, have maybe audio Oh, vo voice voice will be a reactive object so we'll have a reactive object with um, volume like zero for now and like pen also zero so these parameters should translate like voice volume why not defined const voice hey come on voice is here okay and um, okay at drag handler uh, let's see like we have the movement and we have X and uh, Y and we have uh, let's say uh, voice volume we just have whatever X and Y is there and uh, height is not 
not what we need here. Mm. Let's just take it away for now and let's just show voice volume. Yeah, okay. Nice, that's, that's the number. We can drag it, we can adjust it for our needs. Uh, but uh, what if we have it already? So it should be mm, maxed to cap of 100%. So if voice volume is more than 100, then voice volume is 100 yeah so oh or mm -hmm. um, okay if voice volume is less than zero then voice volume is zero okay so now we have it 100 it just moves between the uh, the uh, numbers that we need yeah so here we can have again I'll just remember so we have style with the object of um, height uh, of, of uh, voice dot volume plus percent okay so what we got here yeah it, it's somehow working but if we have this bg gray 500 we can see it all right but it's already the thing that we need because um, now I can just check how I built it before. <laughs> uh, note button, uh, note cell, cell content. I guess that's here what we get. No, it's in the note cell. Background color. So if we move this height. So it's level and note button. I need the styles to understand everything. So note, 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 uh, note button. We have it relative. Um, again, note cell. This note button inside of it, we have the level. So note button and inside of it we have the note button relative. It's it's not it's not flex and level with absolute. Wow, really nice thing, really nice thing. Uh, so we can have these as absolute. this as relative relative and why i can if if i if it's like that okay what, what's now i can have the volume indicator so uh, like width is uh, 1 em you know, and um, and th this with its one and two. Where is it? <laughs> All right. And by the way, here I can see that flex is not the thing that. I should use here because uh, I need everything to be nice and aligned and it uh, will be done 
uh, with tables so it should be a table uh, it's perfectly nice it's not very hard to implement and um, let's go do it and find out what's next I think so in app view we get here uh, we get the control and this is where the octaves are uh, enumerated so it's a table this is a table row inside of it and this is a td with is oh i forgot table cell is table cell like this no it doesn't work mm. okay i shouldn't do this table cell okay and table cell for itself will be a td and not so flex maybe let's look at it what does it have for us so table tr td oh. why this td isn't how can it be of course because no i can't understand it's a row why is it uh, on the other line very strange so it's table row table row okay it's flex and then doesn't do what it should do hmm table cell maybe it's table cell that's absolute let's try to remove this remove this it's the cell oh maybe here i have uh, some flex no width width and height no should shouldn't look like this flex padding padding flex direction hmm very strange thing oh td this is a TD, this is a TD. Table. I don't know what's happening. I'm sure it's so easy to understand, but I can't figure out this simple thing. Why a TR? Table. HTML table, what's what's happening? It's such a clean thing, it shouldn't be uh, that difficult. I don't know, it's it's here, it's just so easy. But not so easy oh. okay I don't want to have so much time with it it's my fault I don't know what's the what's my fault <laughs> now but I'll take care of it later yeah for now this is much more interesting 
uh, and uh, it's really really doable uh, so let's have some details and the uh, the thing uh, okay if we have this cell and if it is uh, relative so the indicators may work like they are uh, just in s uh, just um, absolute yeah so the cell should be uh, at the top level like it was before like this yeah and then we can have that the cell is absolute is is relative yeah is display is relative and here i can have an absolute 5 px thing with bg bg gray 100 and does it have the width that i need it to have mm. Back to the inspector. So cell has this absolute, and of course it should have h full. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but ah, and uh, of course top zero, left zero. Boom and um, this is width with have full width over these 5px and the last thing is that oh it should work now it, well it doesn't uh, i don't know why but we'll find it out okay so we have this letter and th this is this is the absolute thing and it doesn't change hate is voice volume and drag handler but drag handler doesn't sh doesn't fire up oh no it's now it's working yes yes so something is happening it's okay like if we divide it by i don't know let's divide it by eight and uh, it will be yeah it's it's always a little bit laggy but as we as you know it's it's rather okay for volume it's changes uh, exponentially and we and the this lag is just more nice it's more natural and also maybe i can divide it even more like i don't know 20 so we have nice um, range of movements okay yes so two two like very nice but uh, we have to minus the y yes it grows and for it to grow from the top from the bottom we'll have this to bottom zero okay no mm. Ah, um, what did it? Not level. It's bottom, left, and height, and left, bottom. Why? Ah, it's inside the node button, and um, relative color pointer. Let's see. 
so it should be down there not absolute bottom zero okay maybe bottom zero is here no let's check it out this is absolute this one and uh, this one should have the bottom zero why doesn't because we need to set the position but i have the position of oh i need the position of absolute here too yeah yeah that's it that's it so yes it's over the note but if we just turn down the background here we just have the volume showing and it may be uh, even full width and um, with uh, some opacity set and uh, it will mix can be really fun maybe fun uh, the only thing is that uh, it uh, it's moves from the start point but I want the, from the button for it to start again from zero um, how can I do uh, do it um, so it's volume but if volume is less then zero okay I, I i won't take this for now ah <sighs> just happy that this thing works and uh, i'll have uh, the second one at the top i think that's uh, the penning and um, this should be of course uh, brighter i think it will be nice yeah maybe it should uh, use the color but for now it's okay nice and uh, this second one is the uh, the pen pen uh, so it will be w full full top left bottom won't be zero it will be right set zero it will be h 5 px it will be will have h full it will have uh, left zero oh no it won't be left zero i, sh I want it to be centered and um, width will be set to this kind of thing okay it doesn't show up for now absolute uh-huh this one thing is H should be full yeah so we have it running but the only one thing is mm, is to just set it uh, set it to the center Mm. how should I put it um, in the center but with absolute I just want to read it hmm. position absolute center 
um, margin M auto. Like this? Is it enough? No. But and what does it need more? Text to line. Mm. I don't think that text center will do what I need. Translate. Yeah, I, I, I thought about translate, but I don't know. Is it okay? Maybe it's okay. Maybe it's maybe it's that the thing that I need here. So this will be pen. And pen will have left 50 percent no? okay yeah this is nice this is nice but <laughs> i was just just thinking about it but didn't realize that i want this to move i have i have the indicator here and it should move left to right yeah, and it should move left to right, of course. Okay, so we have... What do we need? We'll have... We'll use the transform, of course. Uh, translate. Yeah, that's nice, I think. If we... Have it oh maybe maybe just just left and uh, translate will be yeah translate will be like if I have a width of uh, for example uh, those five pixels and I have translate uh, x minus uh, minus two and a half pixels. Uh, and then the width, um, the style will be, oh, the style will be empty. It's well, here we have it, five pixels. And uh, then let's try to move it. So um, we have the y, uh, the the x. Yeah, the x. And the x is uh, minus or plus, and what we need to do is to maybe just use the just offset. Yes, offset. Um, so we have from minus one to one. Let's do maybe this but from minus. From from zero, fifty percent, one hundred percent. So it's like something like that, like like voice pen. Let's assume that uh, it will just have an x divided by also twenty. Then if voice pen is more than 100 so we will clamp it voice pen is 100 and if a voice voice pen is less than 0 then voice pen will be 0 okay uh, and uh, then we can have here 
the I know the left just le just left should be voice dot pen plus percent okay yeah this this thing moves all right all right it's it's everything is moving nice like it should move it's it's lagging but I think it's it's uh, the thing that it's how it's supposed to be maybe there should be some smoothing or something but I think if you have to just move this move that you, you can just have a feeling of it and it's all right and then what we want to do is that it's initially it's 50 yeah just like that that's that's it i think we got what we need all everything that we need i think the last thing is the active so uh let's have a com a computed so we have an active but active should be uh, computed so active is a computed that will uh, tell us if if voice volume uh, is um, more than zero so it's active and um, if active the note I think it should uh, ideally it's all about the uh, saturation lightness maybe so I have the HSL and lightness is about the octaves and uh, saturation should be about the volume as I expect and also the I got got the hue but hue is for um, notes pictures so I have I don't have any idea how to implement the active except the border so let's do the border so the cell will have a border uh, border solid yes and the one thing and one more thing I know flex now it's it's rather nice without tables and all. It's, it looks great. Maybe it should be panning should be the line. Yeah, I don't know if it's such a laggy thing, but you know the my view too thing was laggy too. Okay, so if it's active, so it's capacity will be 100 yeah uh, so, and this means that I have a class of act of object of active just like that so here I have a cell and it's active it's not active it's active it's not active right there and uh, cell cell I, oh sorry uh, cell that active will have uh, will uh, have apply uh, opacity opacity 90 yeah yeah that's that's pretty pretty nice 
I see what's fired, what I can adjust it. It's really nice. Wow. <laughs> Looks alrighty. But um, the border border will be transparent like this and only for active the border uh, will be gray 50 like this nice maybe maybe I don't need the border maybe opacity is what uh, what's enough let's take just the opacity maybe I'll have border back again but I think for now it's already a nice thing yeah like frequency like BPMs so tune to tune tune okay I think I'll need uh, oh and I want the reset reset function so if I click uh, I'll say at click it should um, maybe not if clicked with filter tabs and won't trigger if just clicked so filter tabs it's what I want from the options and how do I get the options options Drag. Okay, it's drag handler. It's uh, by default, but uh, why can I can I can I see it firing from there? Say console log x and y. So yes, it's not filtering the drag handler. So if I just start, it will have the click event. But maybe I don't don't want it like that. So I'll have to use uh, use drag, use drag, and um, to have the options. Or maybe I can set it there. Quick start roadmap um, gestures on drag configuration options on oh, drag options this is what we need so let's clean up a little bit we may have multi-line multi-line info here with back ticks we can have this multi be multi-line too yeah and uh, with multi-line attributes we can have everything mm, better organized and uh, we can see what's happening inside it nice so we have this style and we uh, I don't want to click 
for now and uh, we will uh, use the drag the, the drag options drag options and uh, we'll just uh, use it here not polluting anything in the script so I don't know maybe it becomes a little bit big <laughs> but th it's really easy to um, get some composables and we'll get back to it uh, very very soon um, what we get here is when you use the use drag gesture drag handler yeah so generic options is somewhere okay i understand that uh, the drag options are the options that we have here and um, they are Uh, filter tabs what I need filter tabs true and uh, we'll be triggered after mm -hmm. and minimum velocity swipe duration the only thing i'm concerned of is uh, on the mobile you shouldn't be able to scroll because uh, the everything is reactive everything is catching your swipes but i think for now it's okay Oh, it should be loud and crazy. <laughs> there will be some sounds. So it's okay to not to have them for now. Uh, all right. I don't know. These are the things that Drag Handler is the ha has the... Here they have uh, like two things so I, I'll have to find it myself because console log and and these are uh, so this will be like drag event and uh, like this we everything works fine and we can have here drag event buttons dragging moving but I need uh, the tap tap true okay tap true okay so I can have the tap here and um, if not tap use this for only if it's not tap we will have the logic but else we will have the voice volume set to zero and the voice panning set to 50 now what we got here we can move it all right we can yeah that's what i meant but that's what i wanted to be able to do it's okay it's nice and smooth but when i click it click it click it it's not active active not active that's great that's what we needed from it 
So let's uh, maybe finish it with uh, some nice, uh, I think, nice um, visual uh, kind of thing because it should have um, it should have H full like this it should be like with like one pixel oh not this this is full but this is just pen is okay pen is just one pixel let's try it yeah that's that's really nice really nice and uh, also what's happening if we have yeah maybe it's okay <laughs> Maybe I'll try to make it a little bit more accurate because I think it's about the pixels and we divide it, it's rounded somehow. I don't know, it's laggy. <laughs> Alright, for now, no, no worry. <laughs> so, width will be full. And we can hear it. Uh, width is full, right? So we'll have um, we'll have uh, this not uh, gray thing, but it will have border top. Yeah. Yeah that's nice that's nice and also i'd like to set the background opacity uh, background opacity so it's like bg gray 50 but it's bg opacity uh, 30 like this nice very loud thing yeah we just just set it to 700 hmm. 700 yeah and the opacity will be 50 percent Yeah, just like that. I think it's all right. And maybe uh, the color of the panning, the panning um, should be should be the G opacity fifty two, like this, and this. Yeah, that's nice. But borders, like, I need borders now. And um, maybe the panning should show only for, um, only if it's not 50%, if it's set to some kind of. Or cell should have borders. Let's try it. Border, border, one px. I don't know how it should be done. And what's without anything inside? Yeah. So, like we got the volume. We got left, right, left, right.
all right i think when we have uh, the volume we, when we will have the sound we'll have the opportunity to understand what we need more but for now that's great that's nice i need to check this out on the mobile and uh, for this let's uh, build it and um, let's uh, do one more thing let's upload it and actually uh, look at it at uh, our web uh, page environment and uh, yeah that's only 70 kilos of code uh, even if we have uh, The, the the rather complex uh, thing running so it's nice okay and um, I'll just go to FTP my FTP account and then go to the table chromatone center so here we have my previous one and uh, it will be in a new folder old folder previously i was publishing v uh, just uh, from github i got um, the sync but now i can't uh, just sync with github because uh, I have a build um, phase and the build phase is uh, I know it may be configured with uh, github actions but I just I just haven't done it for now table yeah table here and the uh, magic I, I want this to look at it in my just my mobile phone so it's stable yes it's it, it has issues with scrolling and i have to figure it out maybe have a scroller some scroller effect but yeah it's just doing what it's expecting to do yeah I think this is great this is great if if I wanted just a beautiful thing to work I think it's really beautiful already to just look at it and just play with it and uh, when the sound uh, is added it should be really really magical so for now it's that's it let's just commit this gestures commit save all and commit gestures yeah we're, we're done for now see you next time bye